Today we're exploring forces in fluids, the incredible way that pressure is transmitted in all directions when applied to fluids. Get ready to uncover how Pascal's law comes into play, revealing the remarkable way forces travel through fluids. Let's talk about force transmission in fluids. It's like a hidden web connecting every part of the fluid. When you press on one part of the fluid, like squeezing a water balloon, that force is transmitted equally to all directions within the fluid. It's like a chain reaction of whispers, but with forces. Enter Pascal's Law, the star of our show. Pascal's Law states that when you apply pressure to a fluid in a closed container, that pressure is transmitted equally to every part of the fluid and the walls of the container. Imagine you have a hydraulic lid. When you push down on one side, Pascal's Law ensures that the pressure you apply is transmitted through the fluid, causing the other side to lift. Imagine how the lift would fail if pressure was applied unevenly. This law has mind-boggling applications. Think about hydraulic brakes in a car. A small force on the brake pedal gets magnified through Pascal's Law, applying strong pressure to the brake pads and slowing the car down. And in a syringe, another everyday example, applying a small force to the plunger creates a much larger force at the needle, allowing us to inject fluids with precision. So, whether it's lifting heavy loads or braking your car smoothly, the transmission of forces in fluids and the magic of Pascal's Law ensure that small actions can lead to powerful effects.